Hey, Shadowheart. Another one survived the crash. I advise caution. You can't approach every stranger you see so openly. I mean, I approached the gift lady and lived. Besides, the more the merrier. Hey! You there! Yeah, the tall, pale, and scary. Yes, hi! May I have a word, please? You a survivor from the ship, too? We're looking for other refugees. That I am. Seems we have a mutual situation, Tiefling. Yes, I... <coughs> the Dragonborn's hand clutches his head, and your mind sink as one. Darkness clouds your vision, as there was a vacancy of remembrance. Despite his exterior, you feel his confusion, his fear, his uncertainty. Our minds... Did we read each other's thoughts? Yeah, we did. It's the tadpoles doing. Ugh, not a pleasant experience I wish to recall. Neither do I. Though, you seem tense. Are you okay there? I wish I was, but... No, that would be a lie. I awoke on the Nautiloid, not knowing how or why I was there. My memories are but mere fragments inside my scattered brain. Since my abduction, I could only recall my own name. Yikes. Could it be the tadpole? Is it messing with your head? I'm unsure. Even if it were the case, our time is limited. Our bodies will soon transform destined for doom. I wouldn't lose hope just yet. We're still tentacle-free. Maybe if you come with us, we can find the cure together. It'll fix the worm and memory problem all in one. Hmm. I'm not against it. We could use a set of stronger arms. I suppose so. That is, if you can forgive my sluggish behavior, I'm still processing everything. <laughs> not a problem. Let's just focus on one thing at a time. Get out of the crash zone, then find a lead. Ooh, I almost forgot. I'm Tavella, but I prefer Tav for short. I'm... You can call me Dirge. I look forward to our journey together. <laughs>